I'm not too familiar with JT music, but he popped on my popped up on my uh, what's it called timeline and Choo Choo Charles rap. I, I know that I reacted to one of these by um, Damn Bull and Stupendium, and so let's get to it. Hawk if you're hungry. Now I know I have reacted to JT music before, but I'm gonna keep it tall. The the reason I'm reacting to this is because it popped up on my page. <laughs> it literally popped up right as I was going to do reaction. So I said, hey, you got lucky. To Warren Buffett, bro. Nebraska's in the building. What the fuck are they talking about, bro? We're checking a thumbs up, bro. If y'all ain't know, <laughs> good Nebraskans in the building. Ooh, that's almost like a double, too, because you're no Buffett. Warren Buffett, this train, they feed people to this train, correct? So you're not a buffet, Buffett. Hey, it's. Maybe you're reaching there, but that kind of... Got insurance, hope you bring it. What resources might be worth risking your life? Never mind your purse. Don't dig too deep, cause it might get worse. You'll dive right into my Spider-Verse. Mm. I'm big and bad, but I'm not a... You'll dive right into my Spider-Verse? Who's who about to go see that new Spider-Verse movie when it come out? Huh? Shout out Miles Morales, bruh. What are you talking about, bruh? Yeah, into the Spider-Verse, all that, bro. We out there. You better believe I'm gonna be up in there, bro. <laughs> Black Spider-Man costume down. Right I'm bad, but I'm not a meme. Just had to blow off a lot of steam. Cause I'm inside of an undersized machine and just floss my teeth with the guy Eugene. Don't bother trying to with the guy Eugene. Quick question. How come it seems like this is the second Choo Choo Charles rap, by the way, which is hilarious sentence to say out loud. This is the second Choo Choo Charles rap I've reacted to. How come they both of them have like the an old timey aesthetic? I don't know why I'm. I just reacted to an ERB. I rewatched the ERB Wolverine vs Freddy Krueger on my main page, so I still got the breakdown glass. I'll go check it out. I'm trying to figure out why. Um, and go grab you a Don DeMarco shirt too. I'm trying to figure out. Why do they have this old timey aesthetic, both of them, like to the song? Like, na, 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 na. throw another quarter in the jukebox, Tommy! Like it, real flapper music. Real Charleston, Charleston, made in Carolina. Real. Maybe it's, does the song have this? I'm inside of an underside machine game. and just floss my teeth with the guy Eugene. Don't bother trying to find Eugene! And never ask me where's Thomas at. You don't want to push me because. Is it weird that I've been watching and listening to this song the entire time and feel like I haven't heard anything he said? Like, I've heard it. You've seen me quote it. The, the shout out to Thomas. I'm hearing it. But for some reason, nothing is sinking into my psyche. I'm hearing it. I'm hearing it. But I'm not hearing it. You feel me? It's weird. It's like, maybe because I'm so caught up in the fact, that, damn, this sounds so much like Stupendium and damn Bulls one, that I'm like, or maybe I'm remembering it wrong. You want to stop digging for the minus sake. Something of mine that you'll never find a break. Welcome to Aaron Hero. That's a word. That's a word. It's like Latin, I'm her. Just like a bridge. What keeps me running? You'll already know if you hear me coming better. Hunk if you're hungry. Hunk for me if you're hungry. Hunk if you're hungry. Hunk if you're running from me. It's the way he's like, Hunk. Hunk if you're. Hunk if you're. Hunk. I kind of like it though. The chorus is, is, is has a mad different feel than the stuff I be listening to. So that that's it fits the old timey. I like the 
I'm not little. Is it mention that? You're retired, I'm mention shot. Why? Because I'm a little mention that could fit the end of the world. Sure. Just like, roll with it, toss some more coal on. I'm talking. Ah, I needed a cryptid to keep me in business. I didn't say crypto, but if you invested, I can promise you. Oh, I like that cryptid, crypto invested flip. That that was that was pretty good. Some long returns. Come on, trust me, followers. If your wallet's hurt, keep holding on. I'll send you home with a golden haul. Nothing insidious to expose at all. Even if there was, would you be so appalled? <laughs> I like the production of this record. Honestly, I think that's another thing that's really gripping me. Even more than the production of the record, I don't just mean the beat. Production means way more than beat. Production means the way you even, you produce the song. It's your choice of melodies. It's 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 the, 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 the choice of where you put your ad-libs at. It's where you drop the beat or where you don't drop the beat. It's where you 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 put the high pitch vo vocal in the background. It's the deciding to go hook. That's all those choices that lead to the completion of the track and what makes the track the track is production. It's not just making a beat. So I like the production of this. There's a lot of bells and whistles with this song, with the the ad libs and the high pitch voice here and the hook. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, it, it, it's, it, you know, you don't get a chance to see their faces a lot. Uh, um, I see it here. I know who he was. He performed at MPC last year. Ah, uh, I know exactly who it is. It's very, it kind of makes more sense. <laughs> very old timey song. Vibes. I like the, the best part about this song to me was the production, honestly. 